Control of fire ants is difficult because the workers protect the queen and move her to safety when the mound is threatened. Scientists eventually may be able to discover a way to lower the equilibrium population of fire ants. One way may be to import parasites and predators from the ants' native South America, such as these decapitating flies. Scientists are studying their effectiveness and impact. Six species of the decapitating flies have been released in fire ant infested areas of the United States. Meanwhile, integrated fire ant management is the recommended approach for fire ant control. It uses a combination of practices over time. There is no single best method for fire ant control because each site is different. However, methods which are effective, economical, and least toxic to the environment are the best options. The most effective control methods cause minimal disturbance to the mound and eliminate the egg producing queen. It is not always necessary to treat an entire area for fire ants. Map fire ant mound locations and treat only the areas where fire ant control is most desirable. This can save money by reducing the cost of labor and materials. Because fire ant workers and other predators kill approximately 95% of new fire ant queens, leaving fire ant mounds in low priority areas may actually slow the reinfestation of the higher priority areas. Fire ant control products are available at home improvement stores, lawn and garden centers, hardware stores, and farmers co-ops. Other products are available only from specialty stores or through professional pest control service providers. Most control products are baits or contact insecticides formulated as dust, granules, aerosols, or liquids.